When is a space not a space? Check this out. Here's a little table and this second group looks identical to that first group. Okay, but if I go up to remove duplicates and I click OK, it says there's no duplicates. If I do equals len to get the length, this is 19, this is 19. Let's try Power Query. Right click, get data from table slash range. OK, I've gone to view and I've turned on show white space. Let me sort these. They look the same. Let's try right click remove duplicates. Nope, not there. So what's going on? And I'm hearing a few of you shout, use text.clean, of course. So right click, transform, clean, because that gets rid of all those hidden spaces and things, yeah? So clean, so we've now done the text.clean. Right click, remove duplicates, and now I'm stuck. So I got this far. This was a query that my colleague Melina came to me with and said, hey, have you ever seen this before? And I thought, text.clean. No, doesn't fix it. And she tried that already because Melina's just as bright as anybody. So I thought, who do I know that's brighter than both of us? I know the MVPs. So I reached out and thanks to Aditya and Mark Proctor and a few others who came back to me with some suggestions and then explained about non-printable characters. So apparently, things like these non-standard spaces and special characters, non-breaking spaces, they do not get removed by text.clean. So what does get removed? Well, it's these control characters. Things like, let's look at number 10, some familiar ones, line feed or carriage return, those are the ones that I'd come across in the past, and apparently all these other ones get removed as well. But what doesn't get removed are these non-breaking spaces. All right, so how do you even find out if you've got one of those? Well, a bit of trial and error really, but one technique is this. I came up to here, I said right click, split column, by delimiter and click OK and you go, oh, this one hasn't separated. So try again, right click, split column by delimiter. There we go, hash 00A0. And if I go back to that little page that we saw before, there's the non-breaking space. So how do you get rid of them? So then what you try, you go to right click, replace values. The first thing I tried was this, this isn't gonna quite work, and replace with a space, and click OK. And it doesn't work because look at the formula, okay? That's not doing it right. So you actually have to come up here and get rid of that little bit there OK, and press Enter, and then right-click Remove Duplicates. There we go. Now, the other way of doing this, if you know where this is, is under the little cog, you do it using special characters, so non-breaking spaces. OK, so you can actually, in here, non-breaking space. If you replace that with space, it then works. So there we go. When a space isn't always a space.